You won't want that, no, that one. Want that one? one. Do you want to do the same one? So you can okay, do go on then. Of course she'd pick the sexy one. She wants to be sexy out there. She wants John Lear to look stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Joel. And I'm Leah. And I'm Christy. Yeah. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> I did a Joel and Leah sandwich. So this video is going to try to be about um, how your accent might change if you travel. Mm -hmm. Christy's a travel vlogger and uh, Instagram sensation. Guilty. <laughs> Guilty. <laughs> <laughs> I am. And she's actually from where are you? Where are you born? I'm from Surrey. Uh, yeah. which is southwest London. Yeah. Um, but I've spent a lot of time in Australia and New Zealand, especially over the past couple of years, and people seem to think I have a twang, and I don't know about that. So for, Joel, <laughs> so for Joel's linguistic ears, this is just beautiful. Oh, this is amazing. <laughs> oh, oh, beautiful. She's from Surrey, but she sounds Australian. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid that the content may be limited just because we're such good friends. We don't know if we're actually going to be able to get a video out. Yeah. <laughs> but your accent can be influenced mm -hmm. a lot, I think, mm. depending on where you go. Yeah. yeah, definitely. From personal experience, from sort of growing up in the Midlands and then moving down to like a private boarding school in Surrey. Yeah. It was just like everyone you were around, no one was from the Midlands. Yeah. There was one girl from like Leeds. And even she changed. <laughs> yeah. well, no, you have to keep reminding me that you're from the Midlands because yeah. I just think, oh, she's a Londoner. But then you're like, no, I say grass and bath. Yeah. I'm from yeah. the Midlands. You just sort of like, you just lose it really quickly. And it's mm. not even, it, at the beginning, it's like a conscious thing. Yeah. And then it's an unconscious thing. Oh yeah, you don't even realize. Yeah. I, I feel like I, if I go somewhere new and I'm, I'm listening to someone who has a new accent and I quite mm. like it, then I'll try and replicate it. And it is a joke. Yeah. And I, th I think that's how I started with like the Aussie stuff. I was like, no, go, like, hello. Like, <laughs> <laughs> and then I was like, that's so much fun. And it's stuck and now it's just yeah, like, my yeah. accent when I'm like, hello. But do you know what? I think that's quite popular. Lots of people that I know that have gone to Australia have had similar twangs. So I think it's because it's so similar yeah. to yeah. British English yeah. that it's you sort of don't notice it. Whereas if you were to move to America, mm. like I think you'd change less as a Brit because okay, it's a little bit too more of a far. Step. Yeah, more of a step. Okay. I don't know. But you might like go R R like Yeah, you might start doing little bits. Yeah, features, like tiny bits. But you can go full on Aussie. Sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> I've actually written some words down that I, just from like when we're chatting as friends, that I've noticed that sometimes you have the twang. So I've written them down. Do you want to read them out? Oh, I'd love you it. You loved it! <laughs> Wasn't a question. Um, for instance, um, when you say the, the phrase... Oh yeah? No, you always go, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, you're going to it, yeah, like A-H. A-H. A-H, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's, oh, I think yeah. that's more of a Kiwi thing. So they oh. say, um, instead of like, eh, like e, they would say, eh. Eh, yeah. oh, yeah. So it's, oh, yeah, oh, okay. oh, yeah. And they say their eyes as yous. So that's why everyone always says, like, fush and chups, as opposed fush to and chups. fish and chips. Yeah. Fush and chups. Fush and chops. That's crazy. I mean, it's not quite like we've that. But never, like, we've never tried to do like no. a Kiwi accent or tutorial Ooh, or anything. Yeah. So Stop it. You definitely this is really that interesting. Is really cool. Yeah. I think I remember when I studied linguistics that they gave us this chart of New Zealand pronunciation, the vowels, yeah. how they all shifted. So, like you said, like the. Um, yeah, they literally like have what, that vowel is now pronounced this and this yeah. vowel this. So you can yeah. actually plot it on a graph. So yeah. then you can just look at it and go, oh, we'd say chips. Oh, they'd say chups. chups. Yeah. So I uh -huh. becomes you. Yeah. Is that correct? Yeah, okay. I becomes you. E becomes I. Wow. Yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think then there may be more. I just can't think of that. Yeah. yeah. Okay. We've got a few Kiwis that watch. So. <gasps> oh, hi, Kiwis. Hi, Kiwis. Hi, guys. <laughs> it sounds like a name that you give to fans. You know, people are really cringe like, Hey Kiwis, today we're talking about... Hey, what about no, this don't... word? Water. 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 That water. one, I think because it's one you say all the time. Yeah. You do say water quite a lot in life, she don't you? She guzzles that yeah. stuff. She guzzles the water. You just end up saying it that way. Yeah, and I think the same with like party as well. Party. I used to say always at home water and party, but yeah. now it just feels like it's more natural to be like water okay. and party. So what do yeah. your family think? Have they said anything? Um, 
they used to mm -hmm. and now I feel like they're kind of used to it because my sister lives in yeah. Australia and so oh, okay. she's got the twang as well oh. and and my parents also come <laughs> oh, oh like, such oh. a shame <laughs> Joel is on fire today <laughs> The accent. Oh. <laughs> Your poor parents. I'm sorry. Your poor parents. <laughs> oh God. Uh, That's yeah. the worst thing. Anyway. No, they they come over to Aussie mm -hmm. often, so they like used to listening to it, I guess. Uh -huh. yeah. And at first they were like, "Why do you sound like that?" But now yeah. now they're I think more accustomed now to they're it, and they, they yeah. just get used to it. Because I mean, yeah. it would just piss everyone off if every word I said in the house, they were like, and it's good, mate. Yeah, exactly. You'd be like, stop making fun of me. Let me yeah. do me. Let me yeah. do me. <laughs> I'm just going to live my true authentic self. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to let my accent drift wherever the world takes me. <laughs> oh, um, what about this word? High five? Okay, it's no. not working. <laughs> you said one at the top of this video, me and Leah clocked each other. What? Friends. Friends. Oh, yeah, that's, that's an E. So, Friends. Yeah. Friends. Friends. Oh, okay. Yeah. So that that does come out a lot with me actually. Yeah. That Q E E to I. Okay. Friends. Yeah. Friends. Just hanging friends. out with my friends. Yeah. Oh, yes. You are. Yeah. Are you? Oh, no. <laughs> These are my best friends. <laughs> <laughs> so how long did you spend in New Zealand? I was in New Zealand for a year, mm -hmm. and then I was in Australia for a year as well, and I go back to Australia for about six weeks every year. So, yeah. and one of my very good friends, Annie is Australian. Oh, yeah, of course. Hang out with her, her all the and time. she has a strong Australian Same accent. Thing. So it's yeah. like, yeah. I never really escape from it. Yeah. No, you don't. There's no escape there. No, I have a lot of Australian friends and so, in fact, even if yeah. I try to lose it, it's just gonna keep yeah. coming back. Yeah, I oh, went definitely. on like a little girls holiday with Christy and Annie and I, I think I texted Joel whilst I was in the car, like, I can't escape the Aussie. <laughs> <laughs> like, had the best time, so definitely go and check that out on Christie's channel. Dirtle Door well. we went to. Dirtle Door. Dirtle Door. Don't say it in Aussie or Kiwi. Dirtle Door. Yeah, Dirtle and that's door. how she says yeah. every day of the holiday. No! <laughs> no, we were going Dirtle Door. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yes. 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 Harder. I personally don't really change my accent that much, I don't yeah. think. Yeah. And You've I think got a very are... strong, posh oh, English accent. Thanks. Well, the only time it's <laughs> changed... It. Thank you so, so much. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, the only time it has changed is when like, I go home and my parents say I've become posher, or when I come back to London, my friends are like, oh. you sound really common. Mainly because we do the Essex accent all the time. Yeah. <laughs> so now I've started doing yeah. more. And you're so good at these, you're so good at accents. <laughs> like, Stop I can't it. believe it. <laughs> So, um, Joel and I do send each other voice WhatsApps all the time in an Essex accent. Yeah. It's just something we have with each other that we find Literally. like really entertaining. Like, I, we always refer to each other as babes, but that's only yes. ever in that accent. Like, I never babes. just be like babes. We'd be like no, babes. Babes. Yeah. 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 Linking back to linguistic y things, yeah. there's two sorts of people the people that don't change their accents and yes. people that do. I what think. What's the type of person? Yeah. What? So, there's a certain thing called overt prestige and covert prestige. <gasps> So if you have overt prestige, you want to change your accent to fit in with the other person. You want to be sort of mm -hmm. seen as welcoming and yeah. standard. So that's, so that's kind of what you do. Whereas I'm covert a, prestige is when you want to retain that accent that you have. Yeah. And you're like, this is my identity. I'm not changing my accent for you. Yeah, covert, um, covert would prestige, you, which I think I'm more Would you identify as the covert I think so. prestige? But it's not like I go, oh, I don't want to sound like you. But for example, if an Essex That's person came up to me, mm -hmm. I'd probably make myself even posher. And I don't know why yeah, it just yeah, happens. Yeah. Okay. Like I just try and make my accent as different as possible. So then Which when I see a posh that. person, like when I go, when I see my friends in yeah. London, yeah. I go a bit more Essex because I'm like, no, I don't I want to talk to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's weird, isn't it? It must be to be like, I'd never want to be the same. I'd always rather be different. Yeah. Mm. But I... It, as a way of survival, wanted to be the same. I remember on my first day of school, I'd cut myself and I was like, oh, has anyone got a plaster? And they were like, plaster? <laughs> <laughs> What's a plaster? And then did you feel they really like, They were like, oh, plaster! And I was yeah. like, I've never said it like that, but oh, plaster? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> plaster, please! <laughs> and I was so there. weird. I felt like, I felt mortified. Yeah. I was oh. like, oh my God, I, I'm different. I shouldn't be here. Really? Yeah. I was like 16, but still yeah. I felt really like, you're I like, don't belong oh, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I don't speak like that. Yeah. See, some like weirdly, even though I do tend to start speaking like the people who I'm speaking to, mm -hmm. wherever they may be from, whether they're really posh, whether they're mm -hmm. from Australia, uh -huh. I I am normally quite proud if I do yeah. sound different to them, yeah. and okay. if like I think opposite feelings to you, yeah. Like if they 
like question something that I've just said mm. and they're like, oh my God, why'd you say it like that? I feel a sense of pride. I'm like, yeah, I'm a British. And I'm like, yes. That's uh, it. Pride of Britain on our channel, right? Yeah. Amazing. <laughs> so it's like we're two extremes. So yeah. Lena's one end, I'm yeah. the other end, and you're, you're like in the, in the middle. middle. I guess so. And that's why we are friends. I don't know why I did We're that. going on a holiday to North of Abu Dhabi. North of Abu Dhabi, girls. Woo! Woo! Girls. <laughs> going to insert a pic here if we can, or the gift. Yeah. Um, this is us on a day out uh, in, in London, London at Leicester Square. Mm -hmm. And the prize was if you tweeted it or Instagram this picture, you could win a, uh, well, that's a actually, holiday. That, well, that's actually a good, a good little plug for the video that we're making on on oh, your yeah. channel because it was the day that we were filming yeah the things to do <laughs> to get you into the christmas spirit this is one of them one of the the prizes was to win a holiday in north of abu dhabi and we just got so excited by this that we just could not stop <laughs> saying north of abu dhabi no, no, i think it's also because they were like you can win win a trip to abu dhabi and then because they saw how excited we got they're like that's north north, north of abu dhabi <laughs> <laughs> it's not actually abu dhabi it's not actually it's abu dhabi just it's just north <laughs> so funny uh, oh my god really good so guys yeah, we have made an amazing <laughs> video. This is falling off. <laughs> yeah, they slide back because they're for kids. Uh, so I got these go. from the kids section. <laughs> you just got like corrected by both of us. Like, <laughs> yes, yeah, there we go. Thanks, girls. I feel really good. <laughs> <thanks, laughs> <girls. laughs> I feel bad making everyone wear these. They're from the kids section of Jumbo, which is like the Cypriot version of Toys R Us. <laughs> <laughs> so I was in Cyprus. I was like, I've got to get these for the class. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So guys, um, this is a bit of a... Uh... <laughs> Good one. <laughs> I'm gonna leave that in to make it see you're bullying me. Good one. So guys, we hope you have enjoyed this video. Um, we've also done a really fun video over on Christie's channel. We have. We filmed it over a couple of days, and it's best things to do in London to get you into the Christmas spirit. So if you're gonna be in London throughout mm -hmm. December, you want to get all Christmassy and get yeah. in the Christmas spirit, then definitely check out the video that yeah. I've made with my best friends. Yeah. <laughs> Friends. Friends. <laughs> and um, yeah, don't forget to go subscribe to Christy. She's got an amazing channel, yeah. absolutely brilliant, she's and good. she's just one of our favourite people ever. Oh, so we're, one of my favorite thrilled. People. we're thrilled that we've been able to do this collab. Yeah. Yay. All right, guys, over and out. <laughs> See you next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.